So the notes used to compose the Ripper riff, that section I've played, were essentially in A minor and we're using the A as the root, the B as the second, the C as the third, the D is the fourth, the E is the fifth. There's also an F and an F sharp. So we have a, a natural six and a sharp six and then a natural seven in the G. So we, we've used almost all the notes of the A minor scale. What makes this riff give you that tingle though, all right, is the last note, which is the tritone. It's a D sharp or E flat, depending on how you want to spell it. I would spell it as an E flat, seeing as how we're in the key of A. So it's essentially in A minor, using all the notes of A minor, including a sharp six, but what really gives it that flow, that, that insane amount of heaviness is that sharp four slash diminished fifth, AKA the tritone at the very end, the very last note. One hell of a riff. Never forget when I first heard it. So memorable, so intriguing, so engaging, so different from anything I've ever heard. That's all I got for you guys today, all right? Let me know what you want to hear next, what you want to learn about, and we'll go from there. Please like, subscribe, and we'll see you next time.